<laughs> I'm Destiny. I'm Sean. We've been friends for over a decade. And we grew up liking different stuff. And sometimes the same stuff. And now we're watching stuff. Enjoy. <laughs> you know, I always enjoy those double claps. Hey guys, how's it going? It's uh, Sean. I'm Destiny. And today we're going to be bringing you some more Dragon Ball Z Abridged, episode 3. And uh, this is uh, her first time going through it. My infinity. I don't know, you've watched it so many, you've watched it so many times, and then you've watched so many people like watching it so many times that it like doesn't even... You probably could have introduced it to so many the people. lines, yeah. One yeah. more person being introduced to it. You just gotta, you just gotta spread it out as much as you can. So today, uh, let's go ahead and get it going. All right. So. Following Pandy's fair to Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball, DCR alone by Animation, Toy Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. Well, Goku was passed, but his sacrifice has stopped a great evil. Thanks to him. Our lives can return to peace once more. Raditz. Raditz. What the hell is that? Guy who's as strong as the time of men says what? That usually gets to him. I think you bet, <laughs> Vegeta. Big shocker, nobody cares. We're ten times stronger than him anyway. We'll go to Earth, find the Dragon Balls, and kill everyone. And we'll be there within a year or so. Depending on filler, of course. <laughs> Anything else we need to go over, Vegeta? Nope. That's about it. Well, fuck. It's cool he's kind of talking to his future wife there. Right? Who? Future wife. <laughs> Vegeta? Bulma? Bulma? I mean, he doesn't oh, know that it's Vegeta Wild. I got you. Saiyan thing. I saw what you did to that Saiyan back there. That kind of power can be useful. What do you mean? I'm going to make you my pupil. And then, I'll use you for my conquest to take over the world. But, but where's my daddy? Hate to tell you, kid, but your dad's dead. Actually, I kind of like saying that. Haha, <laughs> your dad's dead! <laughs> Damn it. This is why I hang out in wastelands. Hello, welcome to the Heavenly Check-In Station. Please no cut in the line. If you are caught cutting the line, you will be sent straight to hell. And so we need Goku here to get to King Kai's for his masterful training, Lord Yama. Give me one good reason I should allow this. Because if you don't, that line's going to increase by six billion! Six billion? I'm supposed to be intimidated by six billion? Please, I can judge six billion souls faster than you take a piss, old man. <laughs> no, I am the guardian of Earth. Could I please get a little bit more respect here? Big deal, I'm the closest thing to a god in this show. Until you get to the Kais. Then I'll be horribly insignificant. I do have a desk, though. It's made of mahogany. Mahogany. <laughs> Uh, anyway, can we please- SILENCE! Mahogany. <laughs> um, sir? What? 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 Oh, uh, sure, whatever. <laughs> he can go to King Kai's, but he'll have to run on Segway. Million mile? Sounds fun. Million miles. Prepare to be surprised. Alright, I'm off. Oh, wait. By the way. Did you see a guy named Raditz come through here? He has spiky hair and a tail? Oh yeah, I remember that guy. I put him in my patented Yamalock. And it worked? No, he kicked me in the balls and ran away. Now I don't know where he is. <laughs> he didn't keep his eye on the birdie. <laughs> huh, okay. Well, bye. See you next time you die. <laughs> Mahogany. So, Krillin, how did Chi Chi take the news? Um. Well, Krillin, what did you need to talk about? So, Chi Chi, hypothetically, <laughs> what would you do if you were told that your husband was dead and your son were kidnapped by his worst enemy? I'd castrate the messenger in his sleep with a rusty carving knife. Oh, then it's a good thing I'm not telling you that. <laughs> My better judgment. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Is that a... Exactly what that is. Relatively well. <laughs> so, are you going to get the other Z-Warriors and go train with Kami? The who warriors? The Z-Warriors. You, Goku, Tien, Tansha, <laughs> Chatsu. That's what we always call you guys. That's the stupidest thing I've ever... Raylan! Where the hell are you? Well, I'm up to get the Z-Warriors. Bye! <laughs> Listen up, Runt! Today we're going to commence your intense training under me! But wait, wouldn't that cause harm? Oh, I love to these episodes. Simply me for years to come? You're a wordy little bastard, aren't you? My mom wants me to become an orc NERD! What? Anyway, I figured to unleash your hidden potential, I'd have to put you in immense physical danger. So I'm gonna throw you at that mountain. Actually, that looks more like a punch. <laughs> <laughs> Any second now. Here it comes. And. This is gonna be a long training session. <laughs> All right, Mr. Muscle Man, here you are in the same way. Now, you might want to pack a lunch, because it's gonna be a long run. Now, I'm just joking, you're not gonna be eating none. Wow. That looks like it's gonna take me a while. Now be careful, but you don't want to fall off and die. That's just a little bit of dead humor. But seriously, do not fall off or you will go to hell. <laughs> Has anyone ever run the whole thing before? Well, there was one man. Well, who was he? I believe his name was... Mr. Mr. Bobo. Bobo! Yes, Tommy? I just received word that we have a new batch of trainees coming. Make sure you take good care of them. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he laughing like that? Because Popo is the fucking shit. He seems messed up. And not just any mahogany, but mahogany from the planet of Valkyor 7, <laughs> where the trees are 300 feet tall and breathe fire. <laughs> from these trees, this desk was forged 2,000 years ago using ancient blood rituals of the Malkior people. <laughs> Not only does this make my desk nigh indestructible, but it can bend the fabric of the universe itself! <laughs> also, it's a very fine material. Very expensive. Very. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Mahogany. That's all that needs to be said. Yeah, so... As you can see, the show just keeps rolling, right? You don't even know. You're like, oh, we're already three, we're already three episodes in. Like, pretty great, don't pretty grand, know. yeah. Yeah, next episode you get to meet Popo's training rituals. Oh, jeez, I really can't wait. I've like, I've seen, I've heard you make a lot of reference to them over the many years about Popo's <laughs> training rituals. I was like, I don't know what you're talking about. Please, what are you doing? <laughs> so, can't wait. Yeah, don't break his stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you super much for watching absolutely and thank you so much for subscribing guys that like it means a lot to us yeah, yeah absolutely and uh make sure you guys make like and subscribe and hit those hell bells so you always get those notifications Angel. all right i'll see you later